Alright guys, so uh, in about one and a half minutes I'm going to try to explain to you how to take off the bayonet lug and side assembly from the front of an SKS. What I have here is basically the rifle itself. I've removed all components, trigger assembly, uh, gas tube, everything's off of the rifle except the rifle left. What I've used is PB Blaster penetrating lubricant. Um, what I did was soaked the entire area um, where both pins are. There's a pin here and here, top and bottom. Soaked it in PB Blaster for an extended amount of time probably 15 minutes or so, went and got some breakfast, came back, I uh, just used a regular lighter to heat the area up, probably 30 to 40 seconds of direct heat um, on, like directly flame on the surface. I don't know if that was necessary, but it did help to loosen it up by expanding those metals. Uh, after that, I placed the, uh, the site assembly right here on a firm, solid surface. Um, I tried the table first, it did not work, so I had to use a solid steel surface. Um, I used a 1 and 16th punch. I would advise using one size larger than this, I believe. Um, this did work, though. I just was afraid I was going to break it the whole time. Um, laid it on there. I just used the hammer you see here um, to drive the punch down. Once it got started, I was able to remove it from the surface. Lean it up on the hammer. That way it would have some clearance uh, underneath so that it could actually fall free. Gave it two or three more big hits. And uh, as you see right here is the roll pin. Um, the same process is going to work on this one. And then I should be able to torque up and down and remove this whole end assembly off the end of the rifle. It actually slides off, the rifle is tapered, the barrel's tapered. So you bust two pins loose, um, provide some torque, and it'll slide off right off the end, and you should be good to go. Um, that is a under two minute tutorial of how to remove the sight assembly off the end of an SKS rifle. Scoured the internet for one and couldn't find one, so I figured I'd go ahead and make one once I figured it out. Uh, thank you guys, have a good day.